Hi, this is Jesper Peterson from KDAV. If you're using Qt Bug Q warning, you should always set Qt underscore message underscore pattern. Setting this environment variable will ensure that your printout include additional information. For example, the function name that the printout came from. Let me show you my Qt underscore message underscore pattern. It looks like this. So what you see here is a lot of stuff and then percent blah, blah, blah. That is printing out the time with millisecond. If it's a warning, it prints out the capital warning letter here. And finally, print out the file and the line number. The rest of it is ANSI escape code. There's a link below here that tells you much more detail. But let me show you what my printout looks like. The time, the, the path name here, and the line number. And here's a message. And here's a warning with another message.